I don't want to sound stupid like bling <laughs> on our interview. Yeah, so um, you'll find the mask there. We're going to put on this for five minutes because I don't want my wool show to have on a mask. But we're going to um, step this year up and take care of ourselves. Right? So here we go. Uh huh. It's a mask for real. And uh, you know when you do things and you're not used to it, I'm not used to nails. But <laughs> Come on over, log them at the The camera look good on Instagram. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. TikTok is supposed to have the best camera. Come on, Mari. Oh. <laughs> it's time to bring out my beauty. Almost? No, it's time, Mari. It's time to bring out my beauty. You know how long I hide it? Mm -hmm. Because the men, them, them just couldn't stop saying, Hello! You know, see how much time I breed? Thank you for the gifts. Oh, so early and you're giving out gifts? You must be rich. <laughs> I heard that you guys on TikTok are rich anyway. So flaunt it. Mm -hmm. Desi, I think I'm going to start the day with some detox tea. Right? right here in my bathroom. Come on over, guys. TikTok. See what Amari day is like. It's Amari DJ Mona Lisa. On I TikTok. need this phone to make my calls because God know I got appointments. And I'm going to miss them. Because Shani ain't here with a car. She went out. She won't be back till till tomorrow. And I ain't paying. Oh, no. Mm -mm. No way. Uh, that's why um, white people stay rich, you know. No matter how much money they have, they still wear jeans mm -hmm. and white t-shirt. Yeah, but we black people, we love to buy clothes. But you see, we were the real Egyptians. So we're used to good things. You got me? So keep on doing your thing, girl. We are the real Egyptians. Oh, you remember the, I don't know if you know TikTok. I met into an accident and, you know, I was on the phone with my, my sister and I was in a car crash. Yeah. Oh my God. Yo, in my song that I wrote four years ago, I said I was in a car crash and it happened on I-95. Remember? I think the accident was on I-95. I didn't know I would be alive. Car crash. Yeah, car crash. I wrote a song about the car accident. Well, years ago, I was in another accident. That's why I wrote the song. And then the song is like twofolded. It, it talks about the car accident and it also talk about a broken heart, you know? So it's like my heart crash and I also had a car accident. So when you listen to it, you're thinking about love. It makes sense. You're thinking about a car crash. It makes sense. But I was in a car crash, darling. I was on the phone. Next thing I know, there was smoke in the car. Bluff! And there was smoke in the car and I was in there all alone. And I was like, oh my gosh. So I tried to open the door and I broke this nail. Yeah, this nail. Mm -hmm. Come on over TikTok. Yeah, I broke this nail. But last night this nail was paining me. So I took off that too. And I went to the nail tech like two times last week. First I went and she was packed. And then I went and she was still a little packed. And she could do my nails or Shawnee nails. So I tell her, go ahead and do Shawnee nails because I wanted to go shopping at the supermarket. I needed some proteins and stuff, you know. So I said, go ahead. So Shawnee did her nails and I plan to go back and I still haven't reached there. So I bought some glue on, but to put on the glue on, I got to take them all off. But honestly, I hate sitting and getting my nails done. You can tell some Adam Fleety Flighty type of girl from... Maliko me just yasso deso up and down and oh gosh me so give mama trouble. Come on over to TikTok. Yeah. Now guys, I ain't gonna lie, I don't really understand over here. I, all I know is roses. And that's so cool. Thank you for giving them to me. Yeah. Mm. So you know what I like about TikTok, the conversations. I remember having conversations over here, but I gotta learn all over. Oh my gosh, 
How am I going to do that? Mm, I got to learn from scratch to have conversations. Yeah, you know, I got to keep up with the tech. I think that's why Jennifer Lopez fell. She wasn't keeping up with you guys. They think that they can just, hey, we got to talk. This is my day. Spam callers. I hate them. Yeah. I like to deal with them. Spam. Yeah. Okay. Did we get the massage in? Okay. We're going to put on a mask. What mask are we going to put on today? You know, I love you guys. Because you encouraged me to stay beautiful. It was because of you I really lost the weight. Yeah. Yeah. You do encourage me, whether good or bad. Oh, by the way, if you look at my videos on TikTok, you will always see some merch added to it, some products. And you'll see the things that I use on my skin. You will see boots like mine, clothes like mine added to my videos. And um, I'm going to add more today, okay? So when you watch the videos, check them out. I have mask, collagen mask and stuff that I add to my videos. Yeah, I do get a commission. Yeah, so that's what's up. Mm. Mm. How come they say my teeth is, is not real? Is it? Mm. Well, they actually shaved down my real teeth and put another teeth over it. I got to do it over though, because um, I need it to be a little wider. In Africa, they were like, you know, you need to let it be a little yellow. They don't believe in white teeth like we in America, you know, like us in America. Correct that, darling. You don't want to sound stupid like bling <laughs> on our interview. Yeah, so um, you'll find the mask there. We're going to put on this for five minutes because I don't want my whole show to have on a mask. But we're going to um, step this year up and take care of ourselves. Right? So here we go. Uh huh. It's a mask for real. And uh, you know when you do things and you're not used to it, I'm not used to nails. But my goodies encouraged me to wear nails and I'm getting to like it. When I went to like um, the, the one that broke, I was trying to like get it off to put on a new one. She wanted me to dip my finger in this chemical and I'd be like, I don't want that in my skin. Because you see, um, things are absorbed through your skin faster than through your mouth and your stomach. It absorbs instantly, instantly. Like I take collagen, you know, to make my skin look young, but you got um, and a real friend, real friend in a real life, yo, you know. You want me to tell you the story about him? When, um, I moved my kids. I'd moved my kids to um California. I was in California living the bougie life. And I came to Florida to do a song for Kemar McGregor. And my family visited me in Fort Lauderdale. And I visited them in Orlando. I saw that they were going through a lot of stuff. So I say, hey, give me the kids. Let me bring them back to California and you all sort out of your life. So because I moved like 10 people into my house, but the house was empty. It was a four bedroom with other extra rooms. It was empty. So they say, you got to go. Because we thought it was just you and Jesse going to live in this big house. So I said, well, I guess that's it. And so, you know, that's where I could mention who's going to live there. And I failed. I didn't get through, you know. And um, I was like, what What should I do, you know? So I was like on the road for like 10 days, apart from driving. Seven to 10 days, I was on the road. And it so happened that I was in the mall. Come on over to TikTok. Yeah, come TikTok if you want to hear this. 